name is Debbie Clymer. My name is Grace Leuenberger. My name is Becca Fry. So my name is Nathan Shansky. I am a junior communication studies major. I am a senior and my major is communication studies with a minor in English. And I am a senior communication studies major with a studio art minor and an internet entrepreneurship minor. I am majoring in marketing with a concentration in design and I'm a senior here. I'm going to be presenting an independent study that I am doing about music therapy. My project is called Harmony and Healing. My grandfather had Alzheimer's disease. I wanted to do a project that would um, kind of provide a way to bring comfort and healing to individuals suffering from dementia. So I'm presenting a book of narrative essays that I've written over this year. It's called 22 Essays About Growing Up. So it's about 115 pages of just different essays kind of all converging on this idea of the process of growing up and things that I've learned um, in that process and they're all in this little book. The piece that I'm presenting is a book designed. We're supposed to pick a person from Time's top 100 most influential people. Um, so I picked Missy Copeland. Love her, she's a dancer. I was a dancer in high school. Um, and so I did a 16-page book about her autobiography, some of the challenges that she's overcome. And then um, our main focus was just laying that out and kind of creating a consistent theme across all of um, all of the pages. Today what I am presenting is um, three so different package designs for yeah. basically pasta. So mine I was going for a little bit more of a high-end sort of design as you can see here. It's very minimalist but um, the abstractions here and a very black and white color scheme uh, kind of evokes a sense of sophistication in it. I wanted to do this project to kind of say that there is a lot that we can learn from the elderly generation and there's a lot that we can do to still improve the healthcare system and nursing home setting. The main idea behind the book is encouraging people to think about what stories are within them and realize that you do have a story to tell no matter who you are. Yeah, I think that the uh, the CVA celebration was a great success. Uh, I mean, there is a very large group of uh, students, faculty, and even community members, and moms and dads, who uh, who joined us for that celebration. I think it's going to grow every year. It's going to continue to grow. Um, I can see us incorporating some, maybe some some music from folks who are maybe in our major, but uh, you know can contribute to to the show with music. I think we can. Uh, also anticipate that there will be additional panels and research uh, projects that are presented during the, the celebration event next year.